Hi guys, today I will show you the video of not the process of repairs but the video with the result of those repairs. The matter is that in the video of uh, radiator removal one of my subscribers asked me to start the engine and I took a special video today showing how uh, the engine with the repaired radiator starts. So I repaired my radiator, I went to those guys engaged in making custom intercooler radiator from aluminum and they made an aluminum uh, side, hot side for my radiator too. So I installed my radiator, but what a pity, after everything was prepared, I found out that some pipes of my radiator were leaking. But it was a pity to throw away my uh, repaired radiator, so I decided to make an exper experiment. I just removed three pipes of my radiator and installed it. And afterwards, I can tell you that my X-Type, it's a 2.1 engine, doesn't overheat even in traffic jams. I don't urge you to uh, remove pipes of your radiator, but I, t I can tell you that in my case, everything is working normally. Besides, I will show you how I tuned the reservoir cap of my Jaguar X-Type. The matter is that my car is already 18 years old and I don't want to make it work under, under pressure. So I removed the valve from the coolant reservoir cap and it works under atmosphere pressure. It will not be torn from inside. It doesn't hit. I just removed the lower seal uh, ring and the atmosphere air can flow into the, the reservoir and vice versa. So I don't also urge you to remove the lower seal ring and make your Jaguar work under atmosphere pressure but I show you that in my case it works. Of course I use the quality G12 coolant and the distilled water. It's your own responsibility if something goes wrong with your car I also I repeat once again that I don't urge you to tune the uh, reservoir cap or remove any pipes from your radiator but in my case it works so and now I will go and start the engine and show you how my engine works I checked it uh, doesn't overheat in my hot climate, rather hot climate. So you see I started it, it works without any problems, it doesn't leak and everything seems to be okay. I am fond of all kinds of experiments, I am an enthusiast. so. I do everything under my own uh, responsibility because my Jaguar is far from a factory warranty period. So if you liked this video as well as the video of removing radiator, please subscribe to the channel.